you're traveling to another dimension. A dimension not only of sight and sound but of mind. A journey into a wondrous land whose boundaries are that of imagination. Hi Chris Fittis here from Legal Jester News. It is not science fiction what the US Attorney General did but it is wrong American citizens no longer have rights to speak out. In numerous court cases, he is deporting people into concentration camps like Nazi Germany with no hearing. Not overseas, but in America. No hearing, no law. Like the Nuremberg laws of Nazi Germany, Holder is taking away civil rights. He already erased Section 5 of the Voting Rights Act. Martin Luther King would roll over in his grave. Along with Holder's New York City mayor and attorney Michael Bloomberg tried to erase the Constitution's Fourth Amendment against unreasonable search and seizure. According to Bloomberg who has put $4 billion to pay out USA mayors to overthrow the law and keep stop and frisk instead. He is breaking the rules of our great country, the Constitution itself. Andrew Cuomo was a Nazi sympathizer with New York State Senator Charles Schumer. Both know Hurricane Sandy was a magnetic bomb. They know Osama bin Laden is alive and living at 229 Woodfield Road, West Hempstead, New York. You could go see our worst enemy living on American soil, protected by criminal politicians whose greed is high, like Nassau County Attorney C.M. Poley. In office 20 years. Like Bloomberg a corrupt lawyer who are using taxpayer money to hurt Americans. Another lawyer and Nassau County Executive Ed Mangano also in on the $100 billion fraud on Nassau County taxpayers. All are in with Osama bin Laden and using county taxpayer money to protect America's enemy and kill the taxpayer. Like Hitler's regime, all make their actions count against the innocent of humanity. We need to try these criminal lawyers as traitors of humanity, like Nazi Germany did. I invite you to check out Holocaust movies or the Nuremberg trial on YouTube. All were lawyers, just like now. They changed the law to massacre the innocent in huge graves. History repeats itself now in America. Because Obama is the son of Hitler and a lawyer too. Hitler escaped like many Nazis and has been waiting to have his new world order again, this time in America. America is the country he did not invade last time in World War II. Hitler is dead now, but his son lives on. That is why Obama returned the bust of Winston Churchill to England, insulted Poland and loves to rip power any way he can. Does he represent the ideals of America? No, he wants to ruin America. He is doing well. In his own movie, Obama 2016 he claims he wants to reunite the Muslim Empire, crush Israel, and destroy America. Americans. Wake up and find the enemy is in charge of us.